Good evening. Welcome. I am calling to order this meeting of the Arlington Select Board on Monday, December the 18th. I am Select Board Chair Eric Helmuth. Tonight's meeting is being conducted in a remote format consistent with provisions by the state legislature for remotely conducted public meetings. I will now confirm that all members present or all members and persons anticipated on the agenda are present and can hear me. Members, when I call your name, please respond in the affirmative. John Hurd? Yes. Len Diggins? Here. Staff, when I call your name, please respond in the affirmative. Town Council Mike Cunningham? Yes. And Select Board Administrator Ashley Marr? Yes. Thank you. Before we begin, please note that this meeting is being conducted entirely over Zoom. It is being recorded and simultaneously broadcast on ACMI. Both Zoom observers and people watching on ACMI can follow the posted agenda materials found on the town's website, specifically the select board agendas and minutes page. Finally, because this meeting is being held remotely, each vote tonight will be taken by roll call. And we have an abbreviated agenda tonight. If you give me a moment to get to that on my screen. We have uh, the consent agenda, consent agenda items two through five. We have a reappointments. Uh, first to the, uh, to the Transportation Advisory Committee with the term to expire December 31st of 2027. That's to Sox Scott Smith and Melissa Laub. Third, item number three, we have a request for a contractor and drain layer license from MTP Communications Incorporated from Bellingham, uh, specifically Mark Pavone. Item four, a proclamation acknowledging the 250th anniversary of the Banimal of Monotomy. This was requested by our economic development coordinator. And finally, request for the Monotomy Grill and Tavern late night event on December the 31st um, by Billy Lyons. So do I have a motion on the consent agenda? That's a motion to approve. Move approval. And then uh, if I could just make a comment. Yes, please. Yeah. Since we're all not rushing out to, to dinner. Um, but the, just it, re relative to the reenactment, um, mm -hmm. a lot of work that's gone into this. Um, there's a lot of planning that's ongoing. We're trying, you know, we've, with the 2025 committee, we've been looking towards 2025, but we're really for all the communities that are involved, 2024 is gonna be a dry run. And so we are gonna have a reenactment that's a lot more in depth than the usual reenactments that we have. So it really should be a sight to see. It's gonna be the same type of reenactment that we're gonna have in 2025. And we're trying to incorporate some sort of a parade in there as well to make it you know, event for people that enjoy the history of the town and for kids that enjoy parades. So um, it should be a, a really good event and I look forward to it and all the planning is still in process, but I'm happy to see that on, on the agenda and there'll be more information to come relative to that. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Do I have a question? I will second that and I'll say that we, I, I like the logo, you know, especially the logo. Untold, the untold stories of monotony at the bottom you know, uh, makes me want to hear uh, uh, about them. And also, I can't let this pass without saying you know, how much um, I am happy that Melissa Lobby and um, and Scott Smith are rejoining uh, TAC. They've been there. I know Scott's been there since the beginning, and probably Melissa is soon thereafter, if not at the beginning. Also, and they are such a valuable resource you know, uh, to the TAC and, and, and to the town in general. And, and so I think between them, I mean, there's probably 100 years of, of work on TAC. <laughs> so, so, so anyways, I mean, uh, I'm once again happy to second. Hey, if I can add one comment, Mr. Chair? Uh, by all means, Mr. Hurd. You wouldn't believe how much time and effort we spent in deciding that logo. <laughs> we had a lot of options and a lot of input. And it was a multiple meeting uh, excursion to land on that, but it, everyone was pretty excited about what, what we have there to represent the town. So I'll, I'll just follow up. I can't believe you having been through <laughs> these processes. It's like, like, yeah, yeah, they're an effort, but no, that's well done. So thank you. Uh, 
Yeah, um, well, I heartily second all, the, all those sentiments. Um, and I'm glad, that Mr. Dickens, that you seconded the motion because I was about to run out of select board members. Um, the, um, but the logo is fantastic, actually. I love that I got a magnet, I think, or a sticker uh, with it. And uh, I'm really excited about the work that you've done, you and your colleagues have done on the committee, uh, Mr. Hurd, and, and I really look forward to it. Like, I'm excited about this celebration. So um, I think all that time you spent on it really is worth it because it's going to be the face of Arlington. Uh, for for an awful lot of people and um and yeah to to mr dickens point about about scott and melissa um i'm a big fan of the tech and i think these individuals in particular have contributed so much so i'm delighted that they are uh, they're ready for more so any further discussion so on a motion by mr hurd to approve the items of the consent agenda and seconded by mr diggins uh, mr cunningham attorney cunningham would you please call the roll yes mr chair mr hurd yes Mr. Diggins? Yes. Mr. Helmuth? Yes. 3 0 vote. Thank you very much. I will uh, note that Town Manager Jim Feeney has joined the meeting. Welcome, sir. We have item six licenses and permits uh, for approval. We have license renewals, uh, a whole list of them uh, that are listed in materials um, on the agenda, available on the agenda's minutes portion of the website and in select board members' packets. So if I have any motions or discussion on those approvals for the renewals. Uh, Mr. Diggins? Yeah, I'll, I'll make a motion to uh, approve the um, license permits. Do I have a second? Oh, you're muted, Mr. Hurd. Second. And any discussion? Yeah, and a motion to approve the license renewals as listed in item six by Mr. Diggins and seconded by Mr. Hurd. Attorney Cunningham. Mr. Hurd. Yes. Mr. Diggins. Yes. Mr. Helmuth. Yes. Three zero vote. Thank you very much. I'm moving right along to correspondence received. We have the Fox Library Housing Feasibility Study from Claire Ricker, the Director of Planning and Community Development. We have a request for speed bumps and stop signs on Appleton Street from Jeff Elias at 384 Appleton Street, and a memo from the town manager about vacation buyback. So entertain uh, motions and discussion. Thank um, you. Mr. Diggins? Mr. Hurt, can you go? <laughs> oh, no. I'll move receipt and I'll give <clears throat> our new town manager the same advice that I think I gave a few town managers past, and that it's certainly happy to see the, the hard work that you put in that have created excess vacation days, but we all know how hard this job can be. And we certainly encourage you to take your vacation days. And that, uh, I think I've said that to, to at least one town manager before. I, I don't know if I ever said it to Mr. Mr. Pooler, but just food for thought. Thank Understood. you. Thank you. <laughs> Mr. Diggins. Well, well, I'm going to add to that. Vacations stress me out. I mean, sometimes it stress me so, 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 so sometimes it's like, I mean, less is more, you know, especially when I have to like come back me to like a lot of stuff. But and then, as some people say, in fact, you know, one person that we met with recently said, when, when, um, when, when you do what you enjoy, you know, you know, you're, you're not really working. And I certainly get the sense that Mr. Feeney is doing what he's doing, but he'll, he'll, He'll take care of himself, but I hear where you're coming from, Mr. Hurt. You know, I mean, I'm just, I'm just giving you a hard time. And I also say that I'd like to see that we send that, um, that second um letter, uh, or the second number, item number eight. You know, uh, to Mr. Feeney. You know, and he can direct it um, from, he can direct it. You know, um, to where he thinks it should go. Uh, and uh, also, I just want to say on seven. I'm so happy to see that you know uh, the the uh, the study about the the Fox Library putting more affordable the possibility the feasibility of putting more housing on top of it. Every time I walk past Fox Library, I just think we we can do more here. You know? so it's, I'm happy to see us at least beginning to think uh, about doing more. And I'm kind of curious about a that technical assistance that 15k plus I me mean, on top of the 77 and you know, how that's going to be utilized. But I'll just save that for my conversation with Mr. Feeney. You know, I'm later. So thank you. Um, and um, yeah, happy second. Ah, yes. I, I was wondering if there was going to be a second amendment to that. And Mr. Hurd, do you uh, you accept the friendly amendment on the referral of the town manager for the uh, for the uh, traffic item? Yes. All right. Any further discussion? 
Okay, so we have a motion to receive uh, with a referral for item eight to the town manager uh, by Mr. Hurd and seconded by Mr. Diggins. Attorney Cunningham. Mr. Hurd. Yes. Mr. Diggins. Yes. Mr. Helmet. Yes. Three zero vote. Excellent. All right, and this brings us to new business. Except in cases of emergency, the board will neither deliberate nor act upon topics presented in new business. Uh, I will go first this evening. I'd like to take the opportunity to thank the voters of Arlington for giving me the privilege of representing you on the select board for the past almost three years. My term um, is up in April, and I'm very pleased to announce tonight that I intend to ask the voters for another three years by running for re-election um, in the April town election. So uh, I want to say all to my colleagues that I have thoroughly enjoyed working with you. The same to my colleagues um, and the town staff. I think it is a terrific team. It has been a deeply rewarding experience, at times an exhausting one, but I think that's exactly how it's supposed to be. And uh, I'm certainly, the voters uh, agree with me, I'm certainly willing to, to go another three years. And I will now move to Mr. Hurd. Thank you, Ms. Elman. Um, first, I am very happy to hear your announcement. You certainly have been a valuable asset to the board in the past three years and done a very good job and continue to do as chair. Um, so that, that is a very good announcement for the town of Arlington. I want to just mention that we, I think it was last week, we had we had hosted um, a regional meeting for the the uh, four municipalities that are part of the intermunicipal agreement for the 2025 event at the senior center. It was very well attended. We actually had more people than we thought that we had, but um, there was a lot of work work was put in by town staff, our economic development coordinator Katie Lusai and Angela. Alzuski who's on the, the uh, 2025 committee with me. Um, and it was very well, it was a great representation of the town of Arlington. Um, so that, that was a great event. The next event is going to be in February. With that, I, in following Mr. Helmuth's announcement, you know, I've had a lot, I don't take the, uh, you know, the decision to run for re-election lightly. You know, I had a lot of conversations with family, friends, um, and just kind of look, looking at my own family situation and, you know, where I fit in. But I think at, at the end of the day, what came for me is I still really have a passion for the town. Um, my, we're gonna be here for a long time. My kids are still quite young and going through the school system and using a lot of the town resources. I really enjoy the board that we have right now. I think we have a really good mix of different viewpoints, which really is effective in governing. Um, and, you know, we don't always agree and that's fine, but we do. So I think I said this about Len one time, we agreed, to, we disagree agreeably. And I, I, I feel like I have more work to be done uh, it's been an amazing six years. I think we've accomplished a lot. I, am, you know, have a, whether it's the 2025 or just event, you know, issues that are facing the town so that are important to me, such as affordable housing and and whatnot. I have the passion to continue on, and you know, based on what discussions I have, you know, I have I'm going to have the ability to continue to to commit to the town and balance my work and my life and uh, my commitment shouldn't, again, the voters determine that they want me for three more years. Um, so I'm happy to announce that I too intend to pull papers once they do and seek re-election for another three year term on the board, so. Thank you, and, and I don't think this constitutes deliberation to see how, how happy I am, Mr. Hurd, to hear that news. Um, you, you serve the town well, you do it for the right reasons. And Arlington is lucky that you're willing to keep doing it. I'll now turn to Mr. Diggins. Well, you know, I'm happy that we're in Zoom because as you know, we're in the room. I have my mask on, so you can't see me when I'm smiling, but I'm smiling and I'm so happy that both of you, you know, have decided to uh, 
the right again in the eight in. And uh, and yeah, as as uh, as Mr. Hurst said, you know, we're 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 a mix. We we're the first mix, but I think we get along, you know, well. We and and, and I think particularly so when when we disagree, and I find it the uh, I find it easy to be agreeable, agreeably disagreeable, because I kind of feel that chances are I'm going to change my mind, you know, if any of you are all disagreeing with me. So it's like I listen and then it's like, OK, what am I not getting right here? You know, so that I can learn from that and go on. And that's because I respect uh, you all a lot, you know, and, and the colleagues uh, who who aren't here. And, 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 and so uh, it's, it's one thing to look different. And come from different backgrounds. I mean, um, that's a diversity in and of itself. But when someone really does think differently and have a different um, viewpoint, and to be not only tolerant of that, or but accepting of that, you know, it really makes you know, a big difference. I mean, and 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 um, that's I feel that we have this you know, in 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 this group. I mean, um, and we're also I mean, everyone works on the benefit of the residents so much. You know, and and so I, I learned from. You all um, respect to that. The OML tends to hem us in a bit. That's the only challenge in, in this job. And I think I tend to be a little more paranoid about that than than others me. But um, as I say to folks, it's not so much about I'm um, thinking outside the box as it is maximizing the space inside the box. I mean, so so I'm thrilled, you know. Uh I I, I don't have anything uh, to add other than um, um happy holidays to everyone and hope you have a good transition into the new year. Thank you, Mr. Diggins. I mean, I'll turn to the staff for new business. Let's start with Board Administrator Ashley Marr. I think uh, she's probably busy administering the meeting, so I'm going to take that as a no new business, and we'll turn to Attorney Cunningham. Any new business tonight, sir? Just happy holidays to all, and remind Mr. Diggins that uh, attention and detail to the OML is a good thing. Never, never apologize for that, sir. Mr. Feeney, town manager. No new business. Happy holidays, all. Look forward to continuing our good work in 2024. Thank you. Um, I will say, Mr. Feeney, that it remains uh, a d delight to all of us that, that you are serving the town. And I think we all look forward to your first full year of service, even though we've known you for a long time. Thank you again for loving this town and for serving us so, so capably. And with that, that's the end of the agenda. I will entertain a motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. Second. All right. A uh, motion to adjourn by Mr. Hurd, a second by Mr. Diggins. Attorney Cunningham. Mr. Hurd. Yes. Mr. Diggins. Yes. Mr. Helmuth. Yes. 3-0 vote. We are adjourned. Good night, everyone. Happy holidays. Okay.